Welcome back everyone. So oh, it seems it's bloody raining still. Been pissing all night. All night. I said, oh bugger it, I'm coming down and unloading mm -hmm. this. Get it unloaded, get it done, get the vehicle unloaded. This is how I parked it last night. So yeah, nothing's been touched. Get it all sorted. What we're gonna need to pull apart, what cans we're gonna put where and all that jargon stuff that we've got to do. I'm just going to put the fridges over here for now, sort them out later. Uh, the washer, I'll plug it in, see if it works. That can can be uncrushed. I didn't grab my bag. And we just got down here. Oh dear. A bit of a tight squeeze through here. Alright, uh, we might put this over the far side. We're going to need to unload on the other side for the steel. I've got the mower over there now. That might be C pot's chock a block full. This one here, so can't put no more in it. Getting close to another scrap run, I reckon. That'll be the go. Take it to the scrap yard. Still got this one here. We can fill up. Debating about whether to keep this thing or just throw it in the scrap. I just don't know. No, it has been a handy thing, but it is a pun in the ass at the moment because it's getting in the road. We're sort of running out of room. I've got a big delivery over here that I've got. Got to get through that sometime. Hopefully today with the good weather for me. That's good weather for me. I can't do nothing out in the rain. Can't get a cold. Got to keep working. So hopefully I can catch up on all of that. Um, I think I've got uh, probably two or three dishwashers over there, a couple of stoves, oh, probably a couple of washers and that sort of thing. So yeah, we'll get to and do those. Well, hopefully I can get to and do those. But anyway, enough jibber jabber and we'll get this unloaded. Gotta get this done before we can do that. Gotta have the space to put it somewhere. So, that's not scrap. <laughs> Don't think that's scrap. No way, Jose. That come off our van. Oh, we're gonna bolt down there. Right, yeah. What are we getting off first? This thing. It was on last. On here. Feels pretty light. We'll whack that down there. We'll get that done later. Not there. Get this one off, the one with no doors. Sort of getting a bit out of hand here at the moment. Had it all cleaned up a week ago. Now we've got too much. Oh, well, that's what you've got rainy days for, to catch up on. It's always handy having rainy days. Now, once I'm finished with these, I'll load them up onto the white ute. Take them to the scrapyard locally. I, mean, I haven't got them here. Still testing the one over here. This one's a washer-dryer combo. I've tested it all on the washing machine side of it. Just haven't got around to testing it on the dryer side of it. Plug this one in. Garlic's with it. It's been rained on. Doesn't matter. Well, I don't reckon. There's no water got into that. I've had it under here, it's only splashed and God knows what, so it should be fine. Uh, put that to there, a bit off the center there. That to there, we'll bring it back up into here. Up there, son. Testing station. That's the only extra one, extra one I've got here. Well, they don't last long. Well, what I mean by they don't last long, they don't last long in, in, in down here. They get repaired and put on Facebook Marketplace. All right, that fixed that point. Plug that in. We're not gonna worry about where the hoses are. Geez, I might have spread that a bit too far. There we go. Yeah, we had power. I sounded heard power. 
fast wash we'll go I don't think we can do a uh, da, 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 da. it's only a rinse spin ah so we got to plug water in it what's inside it nothing I wonder just wondering has it been overloaded don't look like it looks like a good machine this rinse spin well I'm wondering take this down to water level low rinse is fast eco not fast no soak no well, I can only do it that way fast wash oh, I've got to put plug water in it all right we'll get back to that oh that's down there heavy rinse and spin here we go I was added on the wrong one. Dials turned around the wrong way. Right, yeah, we go. Come on. 27, 40. Yeah, I still won't be able to do it. I've got to put water into it. That's a bit dicey, that. It won't select. Oh, go, go, cold, low. Yeah, put it up there. 29, 41, 27, what was the shortest? I think that deep was shorter. Might have to uh, have a look at that circuit board. Uh, I reckon so. Why would you want to change that anyway? Yeah, 29. It's gonna wanna put cold water in, blah, 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 all that sort of thing, so I'll worry about it later. <laughs> get back to doing this out here all right we've got this big hunk of chunk of steel it's going to be cut in half before i can put it in there so we'll just sit it up here for now and get it out of our road up over here to there that's out of our road the 44 gallon drums oh there'd be a lot of water in that now yeah, I was going to try and get the oil out of there, but I don't think I'll probably bother with doing that now with all the rain. That one mightn't be too bad, and same with that one. So, try and keep myself out of the rain. So once I've unloaded the trailer, I'll unhook it. Off camera, of course. You just don't want to be bored with that, I'm sure of that. And um, we'll get the car in here. Get all the good stuff out, all the wire and the cans and stuff like that. I got drenched last night, I'm not getting drenched today. Right there. Now we'll test to see if they are stainless. Get a Neo magnet. This one here will do, got plenty around, done a heap of hard drives. No, she's not stainless, she's ordinary steel. Sit that one up there. Alright, finish with these drums. Just sit them down over here. I've got to cut the tops out of them. There. Feels like there's a lot of oil in this one. Fair bit of oil in that. Caps on there, all right. Fair bit in that. Take that up to the bench. See what we can do about getting the oil out of it before we open her up. Probably not today, but we'll get around to it. Oh, it's done. I'm going to tip those there. Hopefully I can suck it out. Bit of steel there. Over there, we'll get rid of the trailer. 
Okay, what are we gonna get? What are we getting out of here? Oh, here we go. First off the ranks, bring our bag back here. To there. This was our second bag that we've got two anyway. Might have to do a quick video on that. I don't think we haven't got much content. That's got to be pulled apart, so we'll put that over there. That over there. That bit there looks to be a bit bent, so we're not hanging on to that bit. Uh, aluminium, we'll put it in that one. Now, getting down to our box of goodies here. Box is a bit knackered, so we'll empty it out. Don't you dare. Oh, I want to test that battery. That's right. I'll test, see what the voltage is. That there. Yeah, we've got to empty that out. We need another tub. Need another tub for all of ours. Well, here's the tubs. We'll go right over the back, over the back, over here. I'm talking way over the back. Grab that. So as I say, I've got to get to and get that done. Good day to be doing it, like I said. Sit that down there. Put that down there. These in there. This might be a full one in here. I reckon I I reckon I've got a full one in here anyway. Ah, uh, that can go over there. That's a nice chunk of decent buddy wire that. Put it there for now. Usually I'd walk around and put it in its place, but just put it in a couple of totes so that I can just pour it out later. Because all this is all got to be sorted out anyway. So, just a means of processing stuff that's all it is that one there may be strippable I don't know until I get my glasses on the old four eyes sort of thing you know I know that's not that's just ordinary ordinary low grade that one put him over there that's strippable that's got to be dealt with and cut off so that's why I'm just putting it in there Bit of brass bits in there. Bit of wire in that thing. Get all these out, we might be right. Oh, that's low grade, that stuff. Oh, that's that solar stuff, that's low grade, but I could chop, no. Might not be. It's got a chunky, chunky piece in that. Might be stripping that one. Might be coated, oh, that's that full, bottle of solo give it a wash slam it down fast did i scratch that one no i didn't scratch that mcdonald's one it's one i missed last night i couldn't find it i knew there was a couple left in here couldn't find them for the life of me there's another one plus it was raining it's still raining what the devil was that i think it was a bird hitting the window Bloody dumbass birds around here, they go flying around and they hit the clubhouse windows over there even. <laughs> they don't know where they're going. It's almost like they're blind. Drinking too much water. <laughs> you're blind on water. Especially this sort of water. Comes up with blue-green algae. Probably affecting them. Can't swim in it. Going back years ago, no one thought about blue-green algae. I'm talking back in the... Oh, 1960s, 1970s, I don't think they even thought of it. That one's unopened. I'm not sure. Alright, I want to test that. I haven't got a can down here, but I want to test that. I'll sit on that drum to remind me. Put it somewhere else, I probably won't remember. Oh, that's right, we've got a broken glass one in this. Glad I'm doing it the way I'm doing it then. Drag that out. Oh, that's that low-grade stuff. That goes with that. 
that one. And that's what the scrapyard tells me is. This is low grade. I've only got low grade and good grade, which is your high grade stuff, your strip stuff. That's all I got in wire wise. That's all I'd ever do. Oh, there's another full one. Been open that one. We got a fair few out there. There's another McDonald's. Ho ho! We got three to do. Thought I had a few spare. Didn't know it's three. Yeah. Oh, that's got that in it. That goes with that, Ashley. Wicked. Oh, got my finger caught in it. Right, that in there. Right there. Oh, it's got a lot of water in it. So that got some fluids in it. Right there and there. I'm glad I just picked the box up. I've got to cut that one off. I've got cutters over here. That and there. Cut these ends off. So I haven't got around to doing that stuff yet. That big chunky stuff. That's empty. That's pretty good, that stuff. Yeah, we might be able to strip that one. That can go that way. I'm glad I'm in the shed. <coughs> She's just teeming down. Yes, that's fine. That can go that way. That can go into there. Get rid of the leaf. Unhill sort of weather. That down there. That's got nothing in it. Now leave that there. Oh, well that can go in a scrap metal actually. That way. There. Alright, what have we got left? Keep picking that piece up, don't I? That is couple. That PowerPoint. Looking good. That to there, that to there, that into there. Right. That gets rid of that box. We can chuck some other rubbish in there if we get it. Sweet. Oh, that opens it up. Now, I was pretty interested in what this is. So, let's open them up and find out. Some sort of aluminium piping. Come on. That should come out of there now. It's truth. What the devil would that have been? Don't know. Don't know. Anyway, I think that's only a rubber on there. Yep. Oh, screws. Oh, it's a hard piece of plastic, actually. Oh, that goes in extrude into the rude. That there. That there. All right. Put these out. Got someone that wants one or two three or four been told to put them with the rest somewhere around here <laughs> I've got that many of them I think they're way over the far over here there they are that gives us well god only knows I've got some in storage even these 
Tem um ali. Oh, I am saving him. That's got fluid in it. And there is two. What's wrong with those? Oh, she's busted out there. They still may be able to be fixed. Yeah, that's only coming up against that. Look at that, they're closed now. <laughs> Do the screw up. No, your tool. All right, that's low grade. All that in there is low grade. Extruded, extruded. I'll put it down there. That's got to be sorted, so I'll put it in there. Process of elimination, this. That's what all this is. Oh dear. Can't pick things up with gloves. But I'm not handling these dirty old things without the gloves. Oh yuck. Right, put into that wash tub. I think that's aluminium. Feels like it. So that goes over in that tub. Oh, uh, leg piece bit of low grade we'll just chuck it down there uh, brass bits we'll chuck over there they can go straight that way big hunker 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 chunker gas strut she's no longer a strut she don't work All right, I'm trying to avoid getting all this heavy stuff out at the moment. More because I'd rather be closer to that and just throw it straight in instead of lifting it. Not like last night, I had to drop it on the ground. Tell you what, these I'll let the brake drums I'll leave in there because I've got another section elsewhere that I've put them. This all this light stuff's not too bad. Up to there. Now. Yeah. We wanted to check out that, so we'll check that out, find our battery, I haven't moved it from last time, where is it, here it is, plug him in, oh I just noticed something before I even plug it in, here we go, look at this, someone's already been in there, that's a part, yeah I can't turn it, usually you can turn those a little bit, so I'm not even going to bother with that, wonder if it does do anything anyway. Oh, the light comes on. No, it does nothing. Not a darn thing. Oh, well, I'm not buggering my battery up just for that. So that's into scrap. Battery back over here. You just never know until you bring it home. All right, I might need to get the magnet, I reckon. That can go that way. I haven't had any reels of wire from the truck depot for a while either. Where's that? That's underneath that. That can go as HMS, that stuff. That heavy stuff. But I probably won't put it as HMS. I don't get much of it. Right, that I want to keep and that I want to keep. Good little items those. Handy for doing other things. Hell yeah, that is. So my keepsake stuff, I'll chuck in that bucket. <laughs> That's my keeps bucket. For nuts and bolts and stuff. So I'll put it in there, I'll be right. Oh dear. I was going to get close to that. Ah. Bit of alloy there. That's already sorted. I've got to get that bin ready. I've actually emptied it out into another one. Bit of alloy there, then over there. I don't know, I'll have to check that, might be plastic. Hard to tell. Magnets everywhere. It's a metal, it's a metal. Little runner, that into there. You don't know what you're picking out when you grab it with a glove. That there, that there. Bottle down there. 
cutting wheel there, that there. This is where I need that magnet. Come on, come here. You're getting out of there. That into there. Alright, this bit of wire here. It's all low grade wire, but it needs the ends cut and off that anode bar. It's got to come with me. So I'll just chuck that up here for now. That's an easy process. Uh, I was over that way. Don't know why I didn't put it there. That's a full bottle of water. Too grotty though to wash off. Yeah, you what? That rain's really coming down, eh? Unreal. Oh, we need it. Those me have to put a sprinkler on anyway. Now that one don't look too bad. I could fix that. Hell yeah. That's another one. I haven't got around to fixing the other one yet. It's still down there. I'll put them together and then I'll have a day of where I'm doing no scrap, nothing like that. And I'll get in and fix some things. Little projects you could say. Now that looks like steel. Sounds like steel, it's heavy. That over there. That one over there. Bottle, full bottle of water again. Damn, a lot of water. Cutting wheels. Alright, start this side I reckon. It's nothing this side at all. Damn. Not a red razu. It's all over there. Well, undo that, stretch her out. Hang on to that, like I said I was going to. Well, that's that bit of extruded. Uh, that one there I can get out. Get up here and get these brake pads out. those hell no I don't need them anyway I haven't got a key I wouldn't be able to fix that sort of thing that's still got the barrel in that it'd go as cast alloy otherwise if it wasn't in it all right so what have we got left I'll leave the steel underneath these. I want to get rid of these out of my road. Got two cans of paint. Still got paint in them. I'll sit them on the bench here. Yeah, no, I'm not putting these as HMS. Much easier to get a load like this than trying to do it any other way. In. Whoa there! Rocking and rolling. <clears throat> Too far for that. Down there, we'll get the magnet for that stuff. So much easier. Uh, definitely process of elimination. Sorting it all out. Bugger the magnet. 
do it this way. There's that hash brown one I didn't get. Thought I'd lost it. Set it under that, so that's four I've got to do. A bit more brass in that. A piece of brass. A bit more alloy. Yeah, I think I think it's almost the call for the magnet magnet on a stick where have I put it plastic or brass one of the two chuck it down there geez that's a big bolt don't realize what you bring home sometimes put that into there Down there, that there, and that over there. All right, we've got a brake pad in there. Well, that's a packet of screws. I might hang on to those. They don't look like a bad screw. On the bench, where everything else goes, just piles up. That's what I say. I've got to get to and clean that up too. It's always something I've got to do around here. I make the mess, I've got to clean it. That's down there. Sounds like plastic, that stuff I just shrewd. It's going to be a heavy corner. Um, I'll leave that in there until I get these out, I reckon. Put that back to there. Where's our magnet going? Up the front. about it. It's all like magnetise anyway. That must be stainless that one. I don't pick up stainless screws or hang on to them. Sit that up around the corner I don't get knocked my head on. Right that's that one. Get her get around the side here. Hopefully I don't get too wet with all this rain. Unloading these one, two, three, four, six. surprising and how much that little weight adds up right stack it in 20 minutes later I had to wait until the rain had finished so I wasn't getting wet we've had a fair bit of rain really or looks of that Oh yeah. Anyway, put these six in there. That'll be almost a load. For this little thing anyway. Up and over. Might fit a couple more in here. Wouldn't like to go any higher than three high. Just gets too much. Definitely had the brakes on on this one, she's been hot. Certainly 
being very hot with that one. I think I was four high once with these. Get the face out of the road of that. Get in there. Ah, slimy water. That'll come out when I've lifted it up and leveled it out. Don't run over me. Get over there. Get down there. Come on, get out. Two to go, then we'll go and scratch these, well not scratch them, scan the McDonald's tickets. One there, the other one there as well, the other side. Scan these these tickets. Put the rest of the bits of these pieces there. I can go in here. Alright, take the gloves off, work our way through here. Oh my bottle and the can bag fell over. Better fix that first before we get stuck into those. I don't want these blowing everywhere. Damn! drove away without it. Moving it. I reckon that's the go. Should have done. Make more work for myself. I did plug the washing machine in too. Seems like it's done its duty, what it's supposed to do. It's almost a full bag. Get those others that are there in there. Might be able to close the bag up. Anyway. That wash machine seemed to finish itself. We'll get into these McDonald's Duvalackies. Show you what we've got to do here. You probably all know how it all works and that sort of thing. Let's play. It's going to foul up on me. Peel this one off. See what we're going to get. Well, that's an instant win. I still scan it to the phone. It tells me to hang on to the bloody things and God knows what. Uh, scan that one. Don't blow away. Hang on to it with my fingers. That's a uh, McChicken or a quarter pounder. Is it a double play? No, single play. Keep your physical ticket. Yeah, I do that and I get it twice. Right here, we get another one. Sit that one underneath there. Um, if you're, am I missing one? There was an extra one of these. Oh, it's down the ground down there. <laughs> oh, that one's no good. Been too wet. Been way too wet. Oh, we might, we might, we might be lucky. Might be lucky here. Scan again. It's trying, it's trying its darndest. No, it's too wet. Too wet, that one. That one's going to go bye boys to that. I'll get underneath that. This one here. 
It's going to come down another big gust of rain. You watch. That one there, coming up blowy. So, yeah, I hope this scans that. It's not even going to scan that one. Come on. Come on, don't lose out now. No. That one's a dud. Dud rest. I've left it too late, too long, overnight, out in the rain. That's what happens with these. If they get wet, they don't work. So let's try and peel that off. With care. There we go. Got that with one with care. See what we're going to win. There we go. That scanned out. What do we win? What do we win? Is it a double play? No, that's only a single play. Oh, Amazon card. Okay, we'll close that. That's all we got. So out of those, we got an instant win. Close out. Close out that way. Instant win. Chuck this stuff in the bin. It doesn't blow everywhere into there um yeah not too bad yeah all right you're biffing at me i'll turn you off so that i put that through the rinse spin plug water in and that sort of thing i don't think it used any water but it went for 21 minutes i've been sorting a few things out like i got all the steel out and that sort of thing of the of the vehicle um put it in here got the airbag out as well so it took me oh good nearly half an hour to get things sorted out um, I even drove away without the cans being moved off the car had to wait for the rain to disappear and that sort of thing before I actually got over there so anyway if you've come this far don't forget to like and subscribe if you do subscribe don't forget to hit the notification bell and for all of you people that have smart TVs I'll put a QR code up in the corner up here so um, till next time everyone happy dumpster over happy scrappy and I'll see you in the next one. Cheerio!